Have you ever wondered about the strangest objects in the universe? Those that defy the laws as we understand them? Let's take a journey into the depths of the cosmos, where we'll encounter a phenomenon so bizarre, so extraordinary, that it bends and warps the very fabric of space and time itself. This is the realm of black holes. Imagine a celestial body of such immense density, of such overpowering gravity, that its pull is inescapable, even for light, the fastest entity in the universe. This is the essence of a black hole, a region of space where gravity is so strong, it consumes everything that dares to venture too close. Black holes are the ultimate cosmic conundrums, they're the remnants of massive stars, collapsed under their own gravity after a spectacular explosion known as a supernova. What remains is a gravitational field so intense it forms a boundary or an event horizon beyond which nothing can escape. But believe it or not, there was a time when black holes were just a theoretical concept, a product of mathematical equations. They were first predicted in the early 20th century as a solution to Albert Einstein's groundbreaking theory of general relativity. This theory proposed that massive objects cause a distortion in space-time, which we perceive as gravity. The idea of a celestial body so dense that not even light could escape was mind-boggling and for many years, black holes remained a controversial idea. Some scientists even doubted their existence, considering them to be just a mathematical curiosity. But the universe, as it often does, had a surprise in store. As technology advanced and our understanding of the cosmos deepened, we began to find evidence of these enigmatic entities. We found stars orbiting invisible companions, galaxies with supermassive black holes at their centers and cosmic jets of energy shooting out into space. Before we knew they existed, black holes were just a theory, a mathematical curiosity. But then, we found them. So how did we go from mathematical curiosities to actual observations? Well, let's jump back to the mid-20th century. It was in the swinging 60s and 70s when the first indirect evidence of black holes began to emerge. And what was this evidence, you ask? It was the discovery of quasars and X-ray binary star systems. Let's break that down. Quasars, or quasi-stellar radio sources, are among the brightest and most distant objects in the known universe. They emit an enormous amount of energy, often outshining entire galaxies. But here's the kicker. The energy they emit is believed to come from matter being sucked into a supermassive black hole at the center of a galaxy. In the same era, scientists also discovered X-ray binary star systems. These are pairs of stars where one is a normal star, like our Sun, and the other is a collapsed star, often a black hole. The black hole feeds off its stellar companion, pulling matter from it. As the matter spirals into the black hole, it heats up and emits X-rays that we can detect from Earth. But how did we see this cosmic drama unfold millions of light years away? Enter space telescopes. These incredible tools of discovery have allowed us to peer into the farthest corners of the universe, revealing the hidden wonders of the cosmos. It was the data from these space telescopes that provided the first indirect evidence of black holes. So there we were, standing at the precipice of a new understanding of the universe. We had discovered the existence of objects so massive, so dense, that nothing, not even light, could escape their grasp. We had found the shadows of black holes, but as you can imagine, we weren't satisfied with just that. We wanted more. We wanted to see these mysterious objects for ourselves. The next step in our journey? Seeing is believing. These discoveries were just the beginning. We had found the shadows of black holes. Next, we would see them. Imagine staring into the abyss, and the abyss stares back. That's what it was like when we took our first picture of a black hole. In the annals of scientific discovery, 
few moments can match the thrill that reverberated around the globe in April of 2019. A network of eight linked telescopes across the planet, collectively known as the Event Horizon Telescope, captured the first ever direct image of a black hole. This was no ordinary feat. It was a technological triumph, a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. The black hole in question, lying in the heart of the Messier 87 galaxy, is a monstrous entity over six and a half billion times the mass of our own sun. Yet, it's so far away, over 53 million light years, that it appears to us no larger than a grain of sand held at arm's length. The image we've all seen, a glowing orange ring surrounding a circle of pure darkness, isn't just an intriguing visual. It's a confirmation of theories posited by Einstein over a century ago. The bright ring is hot gas falling towards the black hole, heated to incredible temperatures and moving at near light speed. The dark center, the shadow of the black hole, is the event horizon beyond which nothing, not even light, can escape. This image, while blurry and indistinct, has given us a glimpse into the cosmic unknown. It has provided us with a tool to test and refine our understanding of the universe's most extreme environments. It's a reminder of the immense power and mystery of black holes, these enigmatic sentinels of the cosmos. But as much as this image has revealed, it has also raised new questions. Questions about the nature of space and time, about the birth and death of stars, about the very fabric of the universe itself, we had seen the unseeable. But there was still much more to learn. So what's next in the study of these mysterious objects? Well, the field of black hole research is teeming with new developments and intriguing possibilities. One of the most groundbreaking discoveries in recent years has been the detection of gravitational waves, ripples in the fabric of space-time caused by violent cosmic events. Back in 2016, scientists at LIGO, the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, made history when they detected these waves from the merger of two black holes. This not only confirmed Einstein's century-old prediction, but also opened up a new way for us to observe the universe. Meanwhile, theorists are pushing the boundaries of our understanding even further, venturing into the realms of wormholes and multiverses. Some propose that black holes could be gateways to other universes or shortcuts through space-time. These ideas, while still largely speculative, are fueling fascinating debates and inspiring further research. Looking ahead, there are a host of upcoming missions and technologies that promise to shed more light on black holes. The European Space Agency's LISA mission, slated for the early 30s, aims to detect gravitational waves from space, potentially revealing more about black hole formation and evolution. On the technology front, advances in telescopes and imaging techniques are allowing us to probe closer to the event horizon, the point of no return for anything that falls into a black hole. There's also a growing interest in studying intermediate mass black holes, those that are bigger than stellar black holes, but smaller than supermassive ones. These elusive objects could hold clues to how supermassive black holes, which lurk at the centers of galaxies, come into being. The study of black holes is a journey into the unknown, a venture into the strange and wonderful realm of the cosmos. And with each new discovery, we're not just learning more about these enigmatic objects, we're also exploring the very nature of reality itself. As we push the boundaries of our knowledge, who knows what strange new realities we might uncover. In a universe full of mysteries, black holes stand out as among the most profound. From their early theoretical inception to our current understanding, these celestial enigmas have captivated scientists and laypeople alike, generating a sense of awe and wonder that few other cosmic phenomena can match. Our journey began with the early theories, rooted in the groundbreaking work of Einstein and Schwarzschild, which posited the existence of these strange objects. Back then, 
Black holes were mere mathematical curiosities, a product of the general theory of relativity. But as time went on, indirect evidence started to pile up, hinting at the existence of these cosmic behemoths, stellar movements that didn't add up, X-ray emissions with no discernible source, and the detection of gravitational waves all pointed towards one conclusion. Black holes were real. The first observations and direct images of black holes only served to fuel our fascination. These images, though blurry and indistinct, were our first real glimpse into the heart of darkness, a testament to the power and majesty of the universe. They showed us that black holes were not just theoretical constructs, but tangible, observable entities. And yet, despite our advances, black holes remain shrouded in mystery. The latest research and future explorations are pushing the boundaries of our knowledge, diving deeper into the enigmatic nature of these cosmic phenomena. From the event horizon to the singularity, from Hawking radiation to the information paradox, black holes continue to challenge our understanding of the universe. But perhaps that is where the real power and mystery of black holes lie. They are a reminder that the universe is vast and complex, filled with wonders that defy comprehension. They are a testament to the human spirit, our insatiable curiosity, and our endless quest for knowledge. As we gaze into the abyss of black holes, we are reminded of the boundless wonders of the universe and our endless quest to understand it.